Hello and welcome back, y'all. The Play vs. Fall 2022 High School Finals coming at you live with Madden. And I'm here joined with my buddy, India. Let's change that name real quick. <laughs> How you doing, yo? <laughs> I mean, I could be MCC. I'm sure it's a cool individual, be. right? Look, when I grow up, I want to be MCC. Mm, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. My childhood <laughs> dream right there. <laughs> well, we're just jumping, jumping into it right now. This is, once again, the Oklahoma Secondary School Activity Association with Play Versus, bringing you our finals right now for Madden. Once again, this is, I want to say, once again, I'm just checking the bracket once again. Yes, the Cyro Pirates and the Selena Wildcats jumping in, getting our first game started. Yeah, waiting for a kickoff here. I mean, it should be a lot of fun. And, you know, I would be worried on a Thursday about my final on Friday, but these young mm. folks are worried about becoming champions for bragging rights here tonight. It must be done. Some things are more important <laughs> at the time. When else do you get the chance to beat a tournament like this? Man, I wish. I wish. I'd have to play video games after school got off, and I'd have to wait, you know, get off the school bus, go home, hit my buddies up, ask my parents for permission, things like that. But it should be a fun matchup. <laughs> You've got, you know, the Cowboys taking on the Bills. The Bills, man. Josh mm. Allen doing his thing, getting uh, the reps in to make the Bills an elite team. Most likely because Tom Brady's no longer in the NFL. I'm going to miss Tom Brady a little bit, but also at the same time, after what I, the whole story, we'll think about it. We'll think about it. <laughs> <laughs> Either way, yeah, we're just going to start here. The Buffalo Bills, pretty salt team to start with. But the Cowboys, you know how many fans of Cowboys are out there. Oh, absolutely. There's cool. America's teams for a reason. No, real quick, down the 31 line. See how we can try and counteract. Get this real offense going for the Bills. Cyril just getting warmed up now. Yeah, you gotta be see. You gotta see if they're gonna try to go drop back in the zone, play it safe, or try to put some pressure. Looks like only four coming in. Big toss to the right side, but a quick drop. Ah, that's no good. Look, I don't care if it's four and four or four and ten. Back in my day, I'm going for it. <laughs> and I say that as if I'm like 57. I'm not, but still. Nah, couldn't be. <laughs> Madden 2000 on N64. That was my first love when it came oh, to Madden. Yo, it comes the first sports games. I feel like I have to say the NHL 64. Oh, he's going for it. I played NHL. Ooh. Yeah. Just setting up. Well, I'm never too huge in sports games, but I have played Madden. It's a little bit, it's a little bit, a dabble. <laughs> Set up for this toss. More time to the left. Diggs is in there, but a quick roll. I'm able to get a good run with it. Yeah, he's been abusing that left cut to the left side. Done that a couple of times here today. Mm. See if he adjusts on the defensive side with a flat zone coverage on the left. I would have seen a steal attempt going on here, but... Can't be too risky. We're just getting started here. No need to overcommit. Thinking about the play real nice. Now we're never off the helmet. <laughs> yeah, I mean, great blitz there. I mean, he brought just about everybody, played man coverage, it looked like, and he did a great job. I think he was kind of controlling the zone, and the linebacker covered the right uh, slant route. Thought he could have thrown that one deep, but just didn't have enough uh, time with the blitz coming in. Hmm. Once again, setting up. Ooh, the Bills. Trying to charge through, but a trip on the leg. The worst thing is when you know you've... The worst thing, man, is when you know you've got a tackle, but then the tackle takes the running back forward and gives him like an additional two, three yards. It's like oh. I had him stopped with only a two-yard gain, <laughs> but thanks to, you know, the animation, homeboy got a five-yard gain instead. Yeah. That's just part of the game, right? Like, oh, for sure. Real sports are one thing. And Madden is a whole different beast. No, 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 no. Kind of like how, you know, there's some teams in Madden that are great that in real life NFL may not be great. But here's mm. a crucial third to start things off. Third down, here's a run by Cook. Get a run, oh. Cook, trying to get through. Ah. Milking the clock as well in his favor. Making sure he's got possession. So from Cowboy territory now, here's first and ten at the 45 yard line. Well, look at Vander. He's itching to get in there. <laughs> there it is again, that route we talked Ooh. about. 
Yeah, off the left is looking real, real effective for the Bills here. Yeah, he's just kinda, abusing uh, that. Working formula. Off the left one more time. Let's see it. And we got a break. The right. <laughs> flipped it. They flipped it. They heard you. They were like, eh, left. Nah, 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 nah. We're going to do a little magic trick and go to the right. Yeah. We got a delay on the stream? Nah, I don't think we do. Hold on. <laughs> well, we'll check for that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we don't. <laughs> Who is losing their job, you know? Nah, I'm joking. Mm. See, the real mix is can they truly listen to me calling out left and still go left? left. They have the courage, <laughs> the bravery to say, you know what? Yeah, I will. I didn't know we were doing multi roles today with caster and coaching. Yeah. <laughs> but the first touchdown, go over to the Bills. Let's rock, yo. I like the way that it was kind of like he he kind of nibbled and got yards play after play after play. There wasn't like one big home run that mm. gave him. Uh, and he's gone for two here. Gutsy went on a fourth down earlier, converted. Here's a two point conversion. I mean, while it's working, might as well. It seems Sarah's got a pretty good working formula for getting this a little bit of distance needed, oh. but what a steal! And a tackle real quick. Yeah, great interception on that. I mean, if he he could have ran that one back to the house and gotten two points. So great job getting the tackle by Diggs there mm. to prevent that from happening. Yeah, Camel Thunder truly being able to come in here and stop the rush. Big kickoff from Cyril, and here we go with McGovern. Taking a oh his ankle. <laughs> you see his ankles go. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and say 66 was not the intended individual to run that back. Yeah, no, nah, I'm pretty sure this passed to a power loader. That was yeah the slowest since one take off ever. <laughs> the acceleration yeah, that, was not there. No, not even a little bit. But now let's see if you get a good chance. I mean, you look, it's gutsy, right? Went for two, unfortunately didn't get it. So now if the Cowboys can go ahead and score here and take the lead with the extra point. Yeah, just got a good run going. But are they more greedy than Syro? The Bills have been fairly conservative, trying to not run for anything too crazy like you mentioned. Just not looking for that home run. It's looking for that step-by-step -step process of getting that touchdown. Yeah, I mean, Syro will use up like, what, 80% of the first quarter getting that score? So possession's obviously in his favor, and we'll see what type mm. of pace uh, Selena goes ahead and plays here. Or excuse me, Thunder, rather. Oh. Oof, it pause. Technical, maybe? Making adjustments already down six? Are they allowed to pause, I wonder? I mean, I'd assume they might be to, like, think, but... Hey, man. Not my judgment to make. I'm just here so I don't get fined, you know? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> let me check the rules uh, real quick. Let's see. Well, while you um, check that, chat, let me know what adjustments you'd make, if any, yeah. in terms of the offensive or defensive end. Um, for me so far, it's just covering that, you know, with the zone, if you're going to play the zone, covering those flats on the sides, whether it's the left or right for Thunder on the defensive side, because that's kind of what gave up a lot of passes and yardage after the catch as well. Yeah. yeah I don't see... Are we, just, are we just allowing a pause each? Is that a thing? Seems like it, maybe. Unless... Uh, yeah, see, that could be it. There looks like the operations team is trying to figure that out. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah, guess, it looks like if you look at the bottom of the screen, it says pause as left. It looks like exactly. one piece. So you had Thunder that just went ahead and used one, and you've got one remaining for Cyril. Oh, thank you, production. Now giving us an update. It's not Cyril, it's Surreal. See, I told you. I told you. This I know, happen. we tried. <laughs> I messaged them so long ago. Like, we I was went with our gut, up. and our gut was wrong. <laughs> I was hoping. <laughs> Surreal makes them. more sense. <laughs> I guess so. I know. Cyril made so much more sense to me. Because it does. It does. It does. But, I don't know. Like, you know, I, you know what? Surreal. Lap, I'm updating all my notes here. <laughs> yeah, we were looking at it earlier. Earlier today, we were looking at the word, like the name Cyril, and we looked it yeah. up, and we got a definition um, saying old master or something. Yeah, like I mean, that. I looked up three YouTube videos, and each yeah. of them told me how to pronounce it, and it was on point. But you know what? My apologies. I, I'll take the L. Yeah, we just got to hold that. Surreal. Oh, <laughs> surreal. We'll go ahead. No, no worries. Yeah, we're good. Uh, we're looks good. like some adjustments are being made here. Uh, typically, what I like to do, we'll see what it looks like he's adjusting the slot receiver here, uh, making sure the defender is able to match up in speed. And that's the thing, right? We talked about how a team in Madden 
could be much better than the team in real life NFL. So for example, if oh, you're yeah. a cornerback or better yet, a wide receiver, such as like a Deshaun Jackson, who is, you know, a speedster, you put him at wide receiver and just the fact that he's got speed, you can run those fly routes and you can go ahead and try to throw some Hail Marys to him. Where in real life, the man's 37 yeah. or whatever, <laughs> however old he is. He's not he's making like it that far with your young bucks at cornerback, you know? Ain't no way. It's not happening. Yeah, no, not even a you little wish bit. wish it would, but sadly no dice. Yeah, yeah, as we're getting an update, it looks like it might be a venue issue. We're not quite sure what's going on, but some input latency. Hmm. That's not fun. Yeah, you definitely don't want that, especially when you're trying to, you know, pass the ball, run the ball. Obviously, it impacts you as well if you're trying to throw juke moves, this, that, the other. Um, mm. But I will assume that, hey, if it impacts one individual, it probably impacts the other. So therefore, the level playing is even. At least in my book, it is. But hey, I'm not the one in the finals. Yeah, no, it's not us, sadly. I mean, we could be in there, but you know what? I didn't play Madden. I got forced into playing fantasy football this year. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Dare I ask what your record is? Um, You've got 34 me, people watching you, so you Let know. me check. Oh, no. <laughs> this might be brutal. Okay, I'm logging into Yahoo Fantasy. Hold up. Logging into the league. It has been a pretty okay on and off season so far. I've been more or less dunked on, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Um, where can I find my record? Actually, hold on. You know, that, where? is that bad that they hid it from you? Is what it is. Oh yeah, no, I have no clue what I'm looking at. I'm not gonna. <laughs> <laughs> so like, you know what? Don't want to mess up your self esteem as you continue broadcasting. We're not gonna show you your record, but um, <laughs> quick yeah. six zero lead on this one here, though. All I know is I've won like three times, like three weeks out of like what sixteen now. So yeah. I mean, hey, right. I'm looking pretty good, man. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you in the toilet bowl, my man. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it looks like while we're waiting for mm. the uh, situation to get you know figured out, you got to wonder how the lag, and not just not just a lag, but in terms of the pause that we're having in gameplay, kind of impacts your flow of things, right? Oh, I yeah. believe it was surreal. That's up six nothing already. So it's kind of like, hey, you already had a groove of things. You already had a six point lead. Now you get a little bit of a break. And mentally, how does that impact you? Yeah, mentally, it how do you kind of get back things on the defensive side? I don't know. If, I think we ran one offensive play for uh, Thunder. Yeah. That's it. A little, mm -hmm. a little run by Ezekiel to the left side. But what mm -hmm. do you think, man? How do you think it kind of impacts them in terms of getting that pause and that momentum? Mm -hmm. When it comes down to it, when you get a break like this, it's not only mental shattering, but also yeah. you have to find a way to refresh yourself, get back in the groove eventually when you're getting back in there. And also, don't forget your notes. It's so easy to forget what's happening and what you've absorbed in that first couple, like just a little, that first little quarter pretty much of what you could have seen. But when it comes down to getting back into it, it's gotta remember your own game plan, remember what you can do and make sure that those step-by-step -step processes of what you've learned, the skills you have aren't lost to just you being distracted by the overall situation around you, which is input yeah. delay, venue trouble, anything, right? It could yeah. be anything. Yeah, and you got to adjust your game plan too. So say, for example, if I'm someone coming in and I'm not familiar with these two individuals and their game plan necessarily because mm -hmm. we've only seen one drive, but if I'm someone who's coming in with like a pass-heavy mindset offensively, that's what I want to do. And it looks like we're getting right back to gameplay, Ooh. which is great. No reset, no spreads. I can't do math. They told me to find X. I had no idea what that was. Uh, <laughs> so I'm glad we don't have to worry about a spread. But what I was saying pretty much is like if you have input delay on the offensive side on the passing attack, that impacts how you're going to play, and you may try to run the ball, but that's not your game plan. But here we go, though. Exactly. I mean, told me to find X. I looked for treasure chest, couldn't Ooh find it. Off the right yeah. side. One quick distance. Outside of Dallas, yeah, they're a, getting in there. Yeah, that was a great pass there for 21 yards. Found the man open on the right side. Those post routes are kind of tough to go ahead and nail because you got to make sure that you get it right to where only your guy can get the ball. If it's a zone, you want to make sure no one can cut underneath it and intercept it. Let's mm. see if they get this play off with four to go. Well, on defense, keep it simple now. A nice takedown right away. No passes needed. Seven yards gained. Not too much to worry about. Yeah, it looked like he could have juked a little bit earlier to the right side of 63, but got held up in traffic by his own man. And mm. only a three-yard gain. We need some real good pass plays now. You can tell the Bills' defense. You're not cracking through that easily on your feet. Take to the air. Big toss to the left. Oh. Huge interception coming on. 
back towards the side of the Wildcats. Oh, okay, we're good. That could have gotten way worse. Yeah, that's that's tough. It looks like he had two routes being ran in the same vicinity. That's not something you typically want. You want to make sure you kind of throw it to where it's just one-on-one -on -one coverage and give your guy a chance to get it. But that two-on-two -two situation just didn't work out. And now you've got lead and ball on their side of the 50. While we're in the second tier now, this could get only more stressful for the side of Wildcats. You've got to get the momentum going. You're down six. Sidewell's got the lead. They're making good interceptions. I mean, the momentum's clearly on one side here. Yeah. From the gun, it's Allen. Quick toss. Back to the left. Over Liable. Get some good distance. Yeah, this time it was Knox. I kind of went ahead and ran a dig route coming from the right side all the way to the left. And if you're in man coverage like that, or if you're playing back on the zone and you've got no flats, there's no one that's going to be able to get you because those defensive players are worried about the deep passes behind. So they're giving up those underneaths, and that's just how he's chipping away here so far. Josh Allen ripping apart the defense right now. We can see Van Der Esch trying to get in there, sneaking in. All lined up, ready for that run. Allen passed it right off and nothing. Yeah, Stop nothing there. Great job. He's got about 23 yards. I'm sorry, go ahead. I interrupted you. No, no, no. Uh, the solid defense so far from Selena Wildcats. Just good to see that. Uh, they're not looking to let anything through. Can't let that guy get any bigger, right? Two. Oh! <laughs> what a pass! Cody is out here. Yeah, great touchdown pass there. Found it on the route to the middle. Now, it was interesting. You had Thunder that went ahead and clicked on. It looked like he was going to try to undercut the route and pick it off, but then he clicked off, and then 27 was just a couple of steps behind. And here we go, going for two one more time. He didn't get it last time. Let's see what he does this time around. Sure, they're getting clean 18 here. I know what's possible. You know what's possible. Young Surreal. Quick toss. Delayed toss all the way to the right, but a one interception. The Wildcats are looking for any kind of prey they can get here. 17 pressuring, pressuring, but they keep running. They can't take them down for a good minute yeah. here. I mean, this is the second time that he's gotten picked off on the uh, two-point attempt. But what's cool is that Josh Allen, after he went ahead and threw that pick, he kind of didn't get blocked, right? 17, he kind of kind of saw him swirling around to make sure that he can kind of confuse the guy. And look, here we go, 66, looking to run him back again. <laughs> Bro, there's no way. Yeah, there you go. Sit on down, pal. All right, Michelin man, let's, let's get back into it. I Ooh. didn't realize Rikishi made a conversion over to NFL. Yeah. <laughs> Well, a reference that probably went over the heads of folks watching us. Oh, goodness. I mean, hey, it's Madden. <laughs> not the actual players. <laughs> <laughs> now, if we were up there in the stands. Oh, yeah, no. <laughs> that'd be a different story. You wanted to pick six, I assume, is what uh, Kiki meant to say in the chat. <laughs> oh, a huge transfer oh, for Lamb. Nice. 88 tearing through 21 can't make it 23 going in 24 just enough great job there i mean just then that's what we talked about right getting those he ran the mesh play where you had a dig come from the left side to the right and it was those yards after catch that really helped him out i mean they got 88 yards on the passing and here we go time to chip away at this deficit that thunder's facing right now 88 yards so that's got to be hurt the Bills are a little, somewhat reeling here. What a dive into the knee! <laughs> Smart decision to dive, but you got to be careful because if you dive a little bit too late and you dive into the defender, you're going to fumble the ball, but you definitely don't want your quarterback to get hit. So next time, maybe sliding instead of diving right. could be better there, but nonetheless, second and four. Definitely really close here. That was terrifying to try and see if he was going to try and not fumble that, but just in time, we're keeping possession. Cowboys, now it's your chance. It's on the play here. Not quite sure what to settle on, but... This is where we get in there. Seeing patient. Test the patience. Dashing in. Slithering in. Oh, that's... <laughs> Not quite enough. 
I like yeah, the but gr yeah, I mean, great user uh, hit there. Gets the first down to make it first in goal, but that's got to be careful, though, because you take too many of those rushes, especially in the red zone, and if somebody causes a fumble, you don't want to go ahead and create another turnover. You already had a pick uh, on the last offensive drive. And here we go, coming out of the goal line. Quick pass over 21 for the turn right through, and there it is. Cowboys are on the board. Yeah, great run there by Thunder. Great drive as well to come back from throwing a pick early on. And remember, we talked about how it's unfortunate that you go ahead and tackle at the two, and it, you know, when the running back leans up, it ends up being more yardage. So the contact was made by the defense at the two yard line, but Ezekiel Elliott just using those legs to punch it in the end zone. Now, let's see if they go for two, if they're going to run it, play it safe. Nope. Everybody wants to take risks here today. Might as well, right? While you're on the big stage. Well, you're yeah. in the finals. When else are you going to go for the big list? <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> that was ridiculous. Nice catch there. A quick yeah, if you yeah, if you would have thrown that to the right side, it would have been picked up. A great placement of the ball. It was a little off, but I mean, hey, McKenzie's getting in there. Number six, a runner this time. Yeah. Look at the speed. <laughs> a little faster. Just a little faster. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. And set up for the next play once again. Bill could try to increase that cushion of a lead they have there. 8 to 12 can be a little bit scary. Looks like you might play zone here on the defensive side. They line up for the shot. 26 is going for a run. Nah, it's going to roll over 42. Get a little hug in. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be really interesting to see how they go ahead and manage the clock here with about a minute 18 left till halftime. No rush so far, but hey, you've got the lead. I'm sure you want to extend it going into the second half. I believe in Allen. Cook trying nice. to get through, but not as much faith in that one. Yeah, covered the flat this time, right? He might have come out in a cover two, so the flats were covered on the right. That's why you didn't see that pass go anywhere after the catch. They've allowed only five yards on the defensive side, negative five yards when they ran a cover two. It's real. Trying to make this a quick set. But once again, always having the patient play. Looking for that perfect toss. Off to the right, but intercepted by Barr. 42 goal for a huge run. First for round 13, but no dice. This gets caught up in the pile. Great interception there. I mean, it seems like every t every time the Cowboys and Thunder went ahead and picked it off, it was unfortunately in the end zone when it was a two point attempt. But this time, it's a big one, and now they've got the ball on their on the in the red zone here with a chance to go in and take the lead when they were down twelve nothing early on. Mm. Yeah, Prescott now go for a toss. No, go for a run. This is it. What the? Fuck? Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> yeah, couldn't find anybody. I thought he was going to try to force it to 86 on the left side in the end zone. Yeah. But a smart decision not to, though, because you had a defender right there to go ahead and pick it off because he was off his back foot as well. Smart decision to just throw it out. Let's get back with another play. It's second and 10, 18 seconds, plenty of time. You've got three timeouts. No need to force anything. And they get ball back as well. So getting a touchdown here and ball back to start the third, huge for Thunder. Yeah, great decision making here. I'm a, I'm a giggle at it, but the smartest play you can make with the time you have left. Yeah. It's now or never. And of course, that one goes out of bounds, so that's going to stop the clock. Doesn't matter because they've got three timeouts anyway. Keep an eye on those dig routes. Possibly to the right side. Goes to the Trying left to instead. In. Ah, they're keeping us mixed. They even have us they're trying to guess too much. <laughs> yeah, the dig route's what he ran on both ends, but he threw it to the left instead of the right. Mm. Yeah, these players keeping each other on their toes right now. Cowboys, now's your chance. You're right there. You're right there. We've seen it happen before. We can see it happen again. <laughs> Huge toss to the right side, but it's out once again. Yeah, now the fact that you're in the end zone, or the red zone rather, you're there. He's only rushing three, so surreal is only blitzing with three or four. Actually, he's, he's calling a play where it's a cover three sky, and he's got four designed to go in and come attack the quarterback. But he's playing with one of them to come back and play in a little bit of a spiral. So in that last one, only three defenders look to be approaching the quarterback, and now you've only got four seconds. You can only have one play, or you kick a field goal. Here we go. You gotta whip that piskin right now. 
Oh, right on the line. Did he get it? Yes. Yeah, let's go. It looked like it. That had to have been it, right? We're celebrating. Yes. It's a game. We're yeah, gonna have he got a it. Dispute. No, no, no. They definitely, they definitely got it. And they've got themselves a two-point lead here now. Looks like he's gonna go for two, possibly try to punch it in. But I mean, he barely got that. 86 had it on the outside. He extended the ball, crossed the pylon, crossed the goal line, and he gets the touchdown. Mm. Yeah, I know why I believe it would go to like a ref dispute. Like I'm actually watching. Yeah. The now I yeah, I, I thought the same thing. I thought yeah. the same thing. Oh, look at the running. Oh, look at Ezekiel. Ooh, it's oh, it's 85. Nice. Very clean. And once again, you can see the Cowboys, Camo Thunder, leading the team. That quick lead in the second. Yeah, and what's great is you know with with you know it doesn't matter if it's video games or real life or whatever. It's like you never can count anyone out you had a 12 nothing lead for surreal but then unfortunately he went ahead and gave up a touchdown and then he went ahead and threw a pick and then you know cowboys had the ball at their own in 19 excuse me on surreal's 19 oh, and here we go i mean he's look he's gonna get himself something and he doesn't even get to the 20 <laughs> he doesn't even get to the 20 come on man <laughs> Like, at this point, I mean, he can't pause anymore because he used it up. Thunder did. But, like, at that point, it's like, hey, man, I'm subbing you out, 66. I'm going to need you to go to the side. He's catching every time, too. Like, get that. Yeah. <laughs> get somebody I mean, he's kicking there. it to, But it's smart, though, on Surreal's end because he's kicking it to him so there's not a run back oh, yeah. on the special team. So I like it. I like the strategy. There's no shame in attacking the weakness of your, of your opponent. Yeah. Ooh. Use toss to the right side. Yes, indeed. Ooh. Oh, no way. Wow. Barely an opening there. Yeah. Both intercept. It's been kind of pick city by both of these. Dak tried to squeeze it in there. A great, great catch. It looked like for a second it was going to be caught by the Cowboys, but a great effort by 27 to bring that one home. Yes, it's a cliche, but they can get it done. So oh, Alan, going for a pass off or not? A fake? Oh, I'm trying to catch up, but no, you got him. <laughs> yeah, Josh Allen. I mean, he he's known to run the ball whenever he gets the opportunity to, but that time just couldn't cut the corner for positive yardage, and we end up with a second and twelve instead. And see just how. Surreal has been trying to adapt to this kind of defense, and oh. sometimes it leads to plays where you're a little bit desperate. Yeah, he clicked on to the receiver there and tried to die for it. Thought if he just continued running, he would have had it. Here's a big third down. Oh, Day's coming in. I'm putting on the right side. Oh, almost made it out, but seven is too quick. Yeah, 42, tried to go ahead and get that one, sitting on the flat route, came up to it. What a great, great pass there by Surreal to squeeze that one to the right side and get the first on a third down play. Mm -hmm. oh, Kenzie. But again, a pile up. Looks like he's going to get the... F yeah, looks like he's going to get the first down as well. Allen's playing pretty well. I mean, he's got about, what is that, 9 for 12? Over 100 yards. McKenzie's got himself 30 yards. The kind of offensive plays we're seeing are tackling right in. Do you think this is really the right move? Or do you think we can see something more, more creative here? I think you kind of have to play it in the sense of like, hey, I'm going to throw a couple of blitzes. I'm going to try to you know rush him and see what ends up being the decision making. And if he's beating me off of those blitzes, I'm going to try to mix it up a little bit. Hmm. Like, see right there, he took, like, 55. You saw Vander kind of take the risk of just cutting up the middle, and then he was just late because then the running back just went to the left, and Vander couldn't do anything about that. So it's kind of like a guess-and-check type situation. But so far, it's been a good battle between these two. Yeah, a lot of problem-solving to do here. The defense has been more or less completely solid here for the Cowboys. Don't let me curse you now. Good tackle to take down there. <laughs> And now here's the fourth down where obviously a field goal is not going to go ahead and tie things up or give you the lead. All day, both of these teams have been taking risks on fourth downs and two-point conversions. I wouldn't expect anything other than that here on the fourth and two. 
Keep it simple now. Wait to overextend. Get somewhere safe. Beautiful. Get to close that distance like you have before. Surreal has been expert at that. Yeah, beautiful dig from the left side from the tight end to get that one. See Banner once again. Trying to get in there immediately. No dice. A pile up. It's just too heavy. Kind of blitz right through. Yeah, he's trying to, you know, you've got Thunder that's trying to just pack everyone inside the box there. You can see, right? You've got, what is that? Four linemen, three linebackers just kind of bunched up there. Yeah. So they're looking to stop the run. Yes, it's just not like gonna work. That. It's not going to work. So really, you've tried it about three times now. The plan has not changed for Thunder. The formula is going to keep working, going to keep cooking it back up. Yeah. And here's a situation where if you, you know, you're at the five yard line, if you don't get at least two to three yards, that fourth and goal that he's definitely going to go for is going to be a little tougher if he gets it off here and he doesn't. Mm. Very solid play so far. The adaptation's been looking really good too. Yeah. Camel Thunder has been not only adapting to the kind of staggered offense that Serial has. But also just how the interceptions and Thunder's own offense has been really, really quintessential to turn the tables in a really fast way. Because you'll see Thunder go for much more, much bigger plays than Surreal seems to be willing to do. They'll try and run. Here's Singletary. Oh, what a tear right through. We thought it wouldn't work again. <laughs> I mean, he, he went untouched there. Great job by the offensive line to set him up for success there. And now here's a situation where if you kick the extra point, you can go up by a field goal. But of course, we're not going to think that way. We're going to go for a two-point conversion here. I'd kick the field goal, but let's see if he converts this one. Both times he's gone for it, he's picked it. Or he's thrown an interception, if you will. Hopefully it's not the case this time. Best of luck to you here. They get the 20. Allen's going to post it left. Third time. Nah. Third time, and if he runs it back, he gets two points. Consistency. Oh. That's finest. It's too simple. It's too simple. Three times, man. Back <laughs> to back to back. He just can't convert on the two-point conversion. And he could have kicked an easy extra point. I say easy. I'm not the one playing in the finals. But you would have made it a field goal ball game. <laughs> and you can tell just how much Surreal wants to try and extend this. And just how much Thunder has a complete download on what Surreal is trying to really um. Hey, this guy got more yards this time. Look at that. Let's go. Number 66. Actually coming in clutch. Was that the 19 last time? Now we're hanging out at the 23. Oh, the big leagues. Oh, uh, don't see a safety on that left side. No, it's a run play anyway. Mm. Very important call on the dance there. <laughs> I'll let him know. <laughs> can you dance like that? Like that? I mean, I can try it. <laughs> Little knees up, Jimmy. Oof. Little wall. Throw trying to block it all up. Try to bolt that one in there. But now here's a third and ten where if you don't convert on this third and ten, you got to consider punting because you're on your own 23rd and you don't want to give a huge advantage back over to Surreal because he's already got a two-point lead. So interested to see what he does on fourth down if he doesn't convert on this third down. We toss over to Schultz. Beautiful. Look at the moves. Frozen. Yeah. 88. <laughs> Great conversion there. I mean, barely. He needed about 10. He might have gotten about 10 and a half, 11 yards on that one. But nonetheless, gets a first down to continue the drive. Here's a screenplay. Ezekiel, <laughs> holy! Okay. Man, that's Huge that stick run. skill where, like, you don't even have to worry about a juke. Mm. Raw movement. Yeah. Just a flick of a wrist on the left side. Very clean, very clean. Once again, it's Thunder's turn to run that offense. We see those big passes like we saw earlier. Nelly has got a chance once again. Ah. 
Yeah, you saw Elliot. What he tried to do is he ran that route to the left, and he tried to cut out. He tried to come back, use his speed, and gain the edge, but he just couldn't go ahead and get it. Couldn't turn the corner. And it's only a gain of three. Oh, you see Prescott going for that pass right over the head. Almost got that one picked off. Now, look, we've got about 248 left in this one. Mm. It'll be interesting if he doesn't score. If Thunder doesn't score a touchdown and time is not on his side, which is not going to be here in about 20 seconds or so. Right. If he goes ahead and kicks the field goal and takes a one-point lead, or if he's stubborn and wants to punch it in. We just to see what he falls back on because yeah. both these players seem very Look at that. Nobody's blitzing right now. He's got all earn. the time in the world. Nobody's blitzing. You've got all 11 back in coverage. And now somebody comes in. <laughs> See, that's what I'm talking about earlier with these big plays from Thunder. He's willing to go the distance. Take that big risk. And it's interesting you mentioned that because early on we saw Surreal have the first drive. And Surreal was kind of chipping away, right? Ten yards at a time. Seven mm -hmm. yards at a time. But you've got a gunslinger here with Prescott. Why not let it rip? Oh, yeah. Unload the whole clip to get into here. <laughs> You don't have time on your side. This is a smart play from Thunder. Just go for it. Because when else are you going to make that time? Keep an eye on 88. Oh, he's going to let it go. Ah. Side for our next play here. Now Thunder, we'll see if move? Surreal. Sorry, go ahead. I'm not, actually, no, go on, go on, go on. Well, I was saying, it'll be interesting to see if Surreal uses his timeouts so to kind of save more time for him. And he gets the ball back here. Thunder. Oh, my. We were playing in mean, the NFL or the NBA. That was a solo block. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if he had anyone down the middle. At least I didn't see it. He had more of a drag route. Oh, he did. I was wrong. He had Gallup running across the middle. So that's a great defensive play Whoa. by the lineman. Because he definitely would have converted on the first. Yeah, really clean. See Prescott again. Well, that toss to the left side. Lamb. Ah, oh, getting tangled up. Some good distance, nonetheless. Yeah, and this is a timeout that we talked about, right? It's like, hey, you're preserving the clock because now, if Thunder does not convert on this third and eight, does he just kick the field goal, or does he risk it for the biscuit, if you will, and tries to go for a touchdown? Well, that biscuit. Upcoming delicious, Super Bowl though. match here. They definitely got to go for it. I can't see a reason why these players wouldn't go for all the beans. At this point in time, especially with how Thunder's been playing, yeah, I don't see a field goal coming into play here. Huge toss to the right side. It's gone long, though. Great defense there. I mean, you saw Hyde being controlled. Covered the run to their left. Went right back side. Now, here we go. Is he going to go for it, or is he going to kick a field goal? Once again, There's no lead. way. There's no way. He's not oh, trusting his defense. Point. Not Come trusting on. his defense at all. you got to be able to trust the defense at this point in time. It's now is the time where you need to trust it. Desperation time. Prescott, on fours. Prescott looking for any opportunity. Right. Down the middle, to the right side. One on one. Oh, oh he got it. Oh, that's money. That. Money. One on one in the outside with Lamb versus White, and Lamb comes up with it. Wow. You know the Cowboys got that extra juice in them. Oh, what a man. catch. Looked like it went right through the defender's hand, but what a big play, man. And, of course, they're going to go for two. This one yep. it kind of makes sense. I'm not too mad at it. Oh, he's offsides for a second. Yeah, that's nothing there. But, man. That's huge. This is that's, this puts the entire yeah. table on – flips the table on Surreal here. Yeah, it really does. I mean, you had a one play where you stop him and you go ahead and run the ball out. You run the clock out and the game is yours. But instead – Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. You're staring at a little bit of a deficit. We should start off at the 25-yard line here on the offensive side. And now mm. a field goal. See, if he, if Surreal would have kicked those extra points, he'd be in a situation where a field goal either ties it 
or wins it. But because he continuously went for the two-point conversion, now you're staring at a deficit where only a touchdown can get you the win as you're down four with a minute 33 left in the fourth. And this is game one, so we are going to play a best of three, it sounds like, for the grand finals. Mm. And it is stressful as well when you're at this kind of deficit and you've been holding the lead until all of a sudden you're down four and you've got to make a big play when you haven't been doing that for most of the game so far. You've been fairly conservative. You've been smart with your yeah. plays. But at this point in time, you got to kick it into high gear. Now see those plays that you had Surreal run in the earlier parts of the ball game where, you know, taking those short five, six yards to chip away at it is not going to get the job done because now the clock is not your friend. You got a minute 21 left in this one. You're down four. You're on your own 30 yard line. You got to cook up some plays that'll get you chunks of 10, 15, 20 yards at a time. And the clock is still ticking. Yeah, it's now or never. What draining time here. They pass right away, but just no real distance again. So sticking to their guns with just making those short plays. I guess he tried to be cute with it. We're trying to run the ball on second down. And again, you're under a minute. Still no timeout being called. you got to expect a pass play to Diggs here. And there's Diggs in motion. Right over the right side. Going for a stretch. Holy Diggs. Let's go. See, this is what we need, Surreal. That's a beautiful pass. Gets it from their own 32 to the 43 of the defense. That's the type of play you need. Those running ball, you know, running plays and all that's not going to cut it. But you need another big play here. And you've got timeouts to use as well. So you can throw mm. it in the middle of the field. Here's Allen. Allen once again going for a huge pass to McKenzie. Slips right through a little bit for the extra yard. But we're down. And now it's time. 22 seconds left. It's getting tense. Yeah, now you've only got one timeout because you have to burn one on that play because you threw it in the middle of the field. Here's where you kind of, in my opinion, have a play drawn up to where you can get in the middle of the field. Then you don't need to burn a timeout, go ahead and clock it, and get at least one more play in the end zone. So two plays I think we can easily see. Unless we get any completion, then you might get three. Let's play now. Clock is frozen, thankfully. Now or never. Make it happen, Surreal. Oh! <laughs> yeah, Man. No, that's a wrap. That's a wrap. Yeah, that that's was just a, a line drive of a pass. I mean, if he tried to just throw it over the defender, he had him because they were sitting at, I think, what might have been a cover two coverage. And it looked like he had somebody in there is victory formation. And that should do it here for game one. Mm. Yeah, just 11 seconds left. But hold on to the ball, kill some time. Four, three, two, one. And that is game one in our series so far. This grand finals, the first step towards victory has gone towards Camel Thunder's 17 for the Selena Wildcats. And what a great job coming from behind. Down 12 nothing early on. We've talked about that. Went ahead and went on a 22 to 6 run to come back in this one to steal game one, in my opinion. Uh, just a great job to kind of adjust things on the defensive side, right? He had two interceptions on a two-point conversion. Unfortunately, could have returned it back for the extra two points. But the biggest play to me was before the half when you had Thunder go ahead and get the interception that had the ball on, you know, close to the red zone. So they scored, cut the deficit down, and then they got the ball back in the third quarter as well. And that's where that momentum just continued like a domino effect in their favor. And that's how we ended up with a big, big win to steal game one. And you can see it just in how they play. Thunder's looking for the momentum builder. And now it could crash. Thunder could get intercepted. And then all of a sudden, those big players are looking like stupid opportunities. But on the flip side, when it's successful, that snowball just gets bigger and bigger. Oh, and yeah. Surreal just could not keep up. And that's, yeah. that's how it is. You have to bring the information to the next game and develop your skills around to be able to adapt to somebody who's going to play that aggressively, right? Yeah, and adjustments is going to be the name of the game. And no matter what sport, eSport you play, right? It's like, hey, mm. that's what I love about series. You know, yes, yeah, sudden death best of ones are, are great to kind of build a hype and the nerves and your palms get sweaty and all that. But it's like the series help you kind of make adjustments. So it's like, hey, if he plays with the same team, if he plays with the same playbook, 
how am I going to defend where I was getting cooked, right? And mm. kind of adjust a little bit to go ahead and get some pointers and things like that. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see what teams they bring out, and we'll see if there are any adjustments made. Uh, but serial has got to be upset with himself after giving yeah. up a 12-0 lead. It's all good, though. I mean, I think Surreal played it pretty solid. It was looking pretty good, and you had the right decision-making to try and go for those conservative plays, slowly build that lead, but when the momentum starts shaking out of your favor, they start snapping it back into gear, start changing gears, start making sure you can really feel like you can keep up and not just react. Yeah, yeah, and that's mm. going to be key. Is kind of like even... You know, I often like to say that it's like, you know, good teams make adjustments, but the best teams make the adjustments on the adjustments. So if you know that you've been running one play, but the defense is now adjusting to it, cool. What else do you have in your tool belt to come out and succeed on the offensive or defensive side of things? But here we go, though. Game two. Should be a Huge lot boot. <laughs> he's back. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Did oh, you he's not learn your lesson? Oh, no. Oh. Come on. The steady improvement. The steady improvement's you there. You could have trucked somebody, but yeah, I mean, hey, he's, <laughs> he got a few yards there. Now we're at our own 30, or excuse me, 22. Could have just, you know, yeah, it's tough out there. I'm kind of trying to become a fantasy six. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yeah. I mean, look, at this pace, somebody's got to wonder if he's going to score a touchdown. I don't think anyone has them on their fantasy team. Mm. Looking powerful now. Thunder. Leading this charge. 21, because of distance. Ah, not too, too much, but it's still that one huge step. It's not yeah, just a chunk, a, the step. Yeah, he's done a great job using Ezekiel Elliott. That's the first time uh, I believe that we've kind of seen a big play on the passing side from Elliott. Of course, he's been able to run the ball all day long. How will Surreal react, though? I mean, it's been a really solid offense from Thunder, and we have yet to really see a real answer inside of Cyril High School. It's a real high school. Switch from man to zone. Trying to cover the dig route, and he gives one up Ooh. in the middle. Really solid distance again from Thunder, just waiting for that proper opportunity and throwing it out if it's not going to happen. Yeah, he, he was controlling uh, Johnson there in the middle. Then he tried to cover the route to the left-hand side, leaving the wide-open area in the middle, which is what he was supposed to cover. But he tried to get a little cute. Come on, Cowboys. What are you getting in there now? Again, just effectively closing that gap. And as we saw in the first game, Surreal took about the entirety of the first quarter to really get that first goal and see Thunder is pretty well on his way to getting that already down in just the first uh, three and a half minutes here. Yeah, and we talked about how you had Surreal that used up about four minutes approximately in game one in the first quarter to get a score. But you see a more of a fast-paced offense from Thunder, which is similar to what we saw in that first game. Mm. Well, Brahma got a huge break, and we're already at the line. Great job. You might have to switch over to his zone and try to confuse him with different blitz packages because that man is just not going to do it. You've got Gallup, Lamb, and Ezekiel Elliott as well. Let's see what he draws up with the first and goal. Quick pass over, trying to blitz right through. And we're in! The Cowboys on the first touchdown. Way to punch that one in. I mean, just a great methodical drive by Thunder, continuing that momentum from game one into game two as they go ahead and punch it in for six with about 242 left to go in the first. Used mm. Elliott on the offensive side, on the passing, and obviously punching it in on the running as well. It's looking like Thunder's unstoppable here. We get it down there right away from Surreal, but you can see, see Surreal's going to make similar plays. Jinx. I'm oh, saying you jinxed. You're right. There's definitely you're a right. Caster's Jinx is what you just did. <laughs> See, Cast way to go. Curse. You see you see what just happened, chat? You saw it live. <laughs> I mean, hey, I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best. I, I can't help it. I can't help it. When Thunder's doing this good, I gotta talk about it. And Surreal doesn't seem to have an answer because you see Surreal go for similar plays. The blitzes, the passes, but it doesn't play out the same way. Yeah, and we'll see how uh, Surreal is able to respond back. Because keep in mind, you had Thunder down 12 nothing, Then he went ahead and came back. So the ball game is nowhere nowhere near being over especially of how fast paced thunder plays let's see if surreal tries to match that pace or plays his own way of offense and slowing it down back towards allen cook's got it now easy catch let's out of surreal once again the thunder the lightning the thunder holding the lead 
one game away from taking this series. Hey, look, I'll let you finish that song if you want. <laughs> Lightning in the... No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Huge pile up here. That's my. Uh, it's part of my gym workout playlist right there. Oh, you know what? I can see that being a really solid one. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> Another takedown immediately. The Thunder. Exemplifying, or not exemplifying, um, showcasing that real good defense. That's real can't to really find a good blitz through. Yeah, he's packing it inside, and the linemen are getting that first push to create traffic in the middle. So you've got a chance to start passing around more long distance, but will you take that opportunity? There it is to the right. Barely went ahead and got the first down because he was, again, touched and tackled a couple yards short. But he kept chugging those legs, and he got the first down. He still wants this distance. A lot of fast, too. Only 30 seconds left in the first. At 26, Allen's got it. Just running it out. Yeah, just couldn't get anything there. Defense did a great job covering all of the right side of the field. That's where all three of the receivers went. Nobody on the left side, and Josh Allen just had to make a decision to go ahead and pick up one yard. Just one. Better than none. <laughs> Amen to that. The Thunder, what's your answer to get this interception? Oh, the blitz works through. Doesn't get too far, but it worked. Yeah, picks up eight there on that run down the middle. Now it's third and one. Very, very manageable. And, of course, we know that even if he doesn't convert here, he has no problem going for it on fourth down. Back to 41. And, again, just an immediate smother of the blitz is that Cyril seems to go for here. Yeah, he needed a yard, and he got just that. A yard converts it to go ahead and get the first down. I'd like to see more creative plays come up from Surreal here because we're seeing so much from Thunder bringing to the defense, but what options does Surreal really have to break through? Off of the right. Oh. It's something. Yeah, I mean, he, he, had the, he had his receiver right there, but a great shot by 42 on the defensive side to hit, put the hit on him and cause the ball to be loose. Loose than a goose. Wait for that opportunity once again. Surreal getting stopped a little bit early. It looks like he almost made it out there, but the jokes are too much. Yeah, picked up a six yard gain there. Had the defender loose on the first, but couldn't lose the other three. Gotta move now. I'm sticking. 20 trying to get through once again, but these blitzes are just not getting the distance that Buffalo Bills need. Yeah, no, not at all. And so one of these times that you're going to have what's happening is probably a play-action play where the defense is going to think it's a run, and then you get it thrown over your head. Mmm. Graining that mix into Thunder's oh. head, but it's just not enough to stop him. This defense is like an iron wall right now. Yeah, I thought he could have cut that one inside for a little bit more yardage. Waiting for a chance here, Bills. Left side opening up a little bit. Ah, but it's just not enough. Yeah, it's unfortunate because you had, again, similar problem we've seen in the past where you have two receivers running a similar route in the same vicinity. It's not what you want. Want to have a bit more of a separation between those two. You had a sandwich between the Cowboys player there. This leaves an easy opportunity for an interception or at least a block. Allen, once again, going over the left side. or reliable for Surreal. <laughs> Jumping over. <laughs> I know Great 11's juke last name there. was Gormit. Great juke move there. Get some extra yards. 20-yard gain for Knox, his first one tonight. Come on now. The two-minute warning coming in. So real now is your chance to even this up. You gotta get in there. The Cowboys defense is only getting stronger with time. You can see the download that Thunder is creating on Surreal's playlist here. 
What would be really unfortunate is if he doesn't score on this drive after all the clock that he's milked. Approximately, mm. what is that? Seven minutes? It's ridiculous. Oh, look at that. Tackle, contact, rush mm. upwards. Gets another five yards at least after love, the tackle. I love surreal style of running out the clock as much as possible and playing slow, playing conservative. When you have a lead, when you're yeah. behind like this, it just becomes stressful and more anxiety inducing as time goes on. Yeah, the clock just isn't on your side at that point. And obviously, look, it's only the first half, and that's perfectly fine. But it would be really unfortunate if you use up eight minutes of the clock to walk away with nothing. And here they come out in the goal line set. Surely the blitz works this time. Surely. Don't jinx them. <laughs> Oh, extra patient this time. Yeah, he's milking that clock. This is a tumbleweed tossing across the field right now. Here we go. But again, no, he's got to he's he's burn a timeout here. There's no way he doesn't burn a timeout. There's no he's way he doesn't it. burn the timeout. Bro. Surreal. There it is. Oh, here How it. you okay. don't? We heard you. <laughs> <laughs> I hope they can hear us, because that'd be extra funny if they were actually just... <laughs> I don't know if they can or not. If Russia could tell us, I don't know hey, if anyone can play convert. versus. Call timeout. See, he could have had at least 30 seconds, but now he's got about one play. Yeah. He's got about one play. If he runs the ball, actually, if he can run the ball here, and if he gets stuffed, it'll be quick, and you can call another timeout and have a fourth down play. So, matter of fact, I lied. I think you can get two plays out of this one. So, what I'm hearing is blitz time. Well, I would actually go in a zone here and try to go ahead and play a little quarterback spy. And is he going to run it? <laughs> <laughs> Got to call timeout. Oh, my God. You know Surreal has two plays. Left? Left or and blitz. One. <laughs> <laughs> it's a simple coin flip. Try and block that. Chat, there's no way that we used up nine plus minutes. Nine minutes. And we don't get a score here out of Surreal. Come on, yo, you got it. You're right, the line's right there. Pass to the right this time. You yeah, think you got it? Yes, he did. You know we got it. There it is. The I break that Surreal needed. <laughs> now, Will... They take the extra run. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see what they do here. If they go for a two-point conversion or just go ahead and kick it for the extra point. Just take the kick, please. Please take the kick. Oh, he's not going to. If he's taking this long, <laughs> he's picking his play. He's trying to see what he wants to run. And now that we know what it is, it's time to adjust. This is so funny to me. I, I love the confidence from Surreal here. Keep an eye on the dig routes. In motion to tight end. Trying to make miracles happen here. And we're right in. Yeah. Not quite. But yes, we are in. Yes. Yeah, yeah, they got it. Um, I'm not, not mad at it at all. Uh, <laughs> great job coming out in the shotgun set. If you know, it's, it's one of those things where it's like, man, if you convert, you're the hero. If you don't, you're a zero. You know, mm, mm, and obviously it's easy for us to go ahead and shotgun coach and shotgun play the game while we broadcast. But nice little two point lead. And here's the thing: we had Thunder that scored and got the ball back in the second half in game one, and now it's Surreal that went ahead and scored and now gets the ball back here in game two at the second half. Mm. And once again, this is the prime setup for Thunder to start making those points happen quick. Back to back to back. A rapid fire of offense that the Thunder can pull out is yeah. such a different beast than what Surreal can have. Because if we're this late into the game, the Thunder is able to pick it back up, regain that lead. Surreal might just generally not have time to make that comeback. Yeah, and we'll see. I mean, use up about, what, two and a half minutes Thunder did on his offensive drive. About seven and a half minutes for Surreal. And let's see how much he uses here in the third. Well, starts mm. off with a run, picks up five. Keep it simple now. Your plays are tried and true. And with a quick run to the middle. 
had the stop, but he handed it off to another defender who just carried him forward to pick up big chunks there. Went from the 33 to the 41. I love the idea to try and at least test Cyril's defense in the center there. Yeah. He's feeling things out. You have time, at least. Under realizes just how much the difference is between their attack speeds here. And if Thunder can take his time at this point, it's real again. As we mentioned earlier, just might take too much time in comparison to make a comeback. Now it's a third and two. So, I mean, you know, it's, it's cool if you can milk the clock and score. It's tough when you milk the clock and you don't. But he's got himself a nice little lead here. If he goes ahead and punches it in, it puts him at a two-possession lead, assuming he can go ahead and convert the extra point as well. We're biased. I'm not going to lie. I'm a human being. I do have my biases. But I'm interested to see who you believe Woods is going to win. Would love to get I mean, your insight for real. The amount of adaptation that Thunder has shown has been exemplary for this kind of offense and defense as well. But for Surreal... I want to believe in the confidence, but as it stands now, my bets are on Thunder for sure. All right. The defense has oh, been solid. The offense has been solid. Big play coming up here. You can see. Let's see if it's a fullback. Oh, he gets it's stuffed. too late. You know that Surreal has those reactions. But, you know, Thunder is just an iron wall. Just, I, I can't imagine a way that Surreal breaks through the defense of Thunder right now without something completely different from what we've seen so far. Yeah, I mean, you got to have some adjustments made, and it's unfortunate. But now you got a chance to go to stop him. you still got a two-point lead. Stop him to a field goal if you can. Not a bad run there. Three yards. Mm. No, I would... If I was in Thunder's shoes here, I'd be quite happy to have possession and just be anywhere on the field because the moment that this quarter ends, it goes into that space of time where I believe Thunder will have the advantage for the pure fact that Surreal might just not be able to get the momentum going again. It takes time for Surreal to get the engine warmed up. Yeah. Oh, for sure. Nice pass play there. Picks up about 11. And again, you, we saw in that first drive, you had Elliott that went ahead and got used and abused with the passing. Then he went ahead and punched it up for six. Looks like a similar strategy for Thunder coming out here in the second half. Screenplay. Elliott tearing through. Get some good distance now. Up 96 yards now. Yeah. We'll see Thunder. We're going to close us out. Two seconds on the clock. No timeout. Let's run it out. Nah, going to... Oh, he's got man open on the right. There you go. Oh, what a beautiful toss. Toss. That's a beautiful pass. Way to stay patient. Waited for Schultz to go ahead and run past the defender. Threw it right in perfection in front of the line. That was a great pass there as we start the fourth quarter. We're going into the fourth. This is where you <laughs> oh, want to got, be. Is that okay? Is it Mama Surreal hanging out with us? Okay. If that's, hey. the, if that's the case, hello. <laughs> that's pretty cool. Good stuff, yo. That is awesome. Love it. Love the support. You love to see it. That chat interaction, that chat presence for your team, it's important. Let them know. Make some noise. It's a real, I believe it's possible, but you got to hold this lead as much as possible until I literally curse it again. I should, you know what? Well, I'll tell you what, Mama Surreal, if you'd like, I'll go ahead and dox my man Suplex here. <laughs> uh, I'm happy for you to pay him a visit if you'd like, but a great job once again by Surreal to punch it in with Elliot, and now they're going for two to make it a six-point ball game. Almost there, but a nice catch on 40 there. Yeah, he went, ahead and, the he went ahead and switched um, Elliot onto the fullback and still couldn't punch it in. Should be an interesting kick coming up here. 
You know who it's going to. Is he going to run it back? McKenzie will not return this, and it will be brought out to the 25. How are you going to try to ratio somebody in the Twitch chat? Like, how does that even what? work? <laughs> like, I get it on Twitter. I guess I get it on Facebook, if that's still something people use. YouTube, I don't know. maybe? The bills come to I don't know. To start their yeah, no. drive. Getting creative here. People are trying to ratio anything. Now. Yeah. Now, what's cool is... is you have someone who kind of is methodical on the offensive side and surreal, right? So he's got plenty of time here with four minutes left in the fourth. He scores, he controls the clock properly, and this ball game is his, and we're going to a third third game. I'm going to get cooking now. Surreal, you can see these bigger plays being made. <laughs> Very nice. You can see, like, that's the kind of thing we need from you, Surreal. Like, you can't commit the center drives every time. Now, it's not every time, but I fully believe that with some creativity, Sewer brings us back, gets that lead, and holds it down. A quick run from Allen. Ah, oh, but we're out. <laughs> no, I got to Look, I have never met any of these individuals in terms of who's playing here, but we'll mm. go ahead and make sure we keep it balanced. I mean, look. The play speaks for itself. That's all I got to say. <laughs> We're simply casters here. We talk about the play. Right to the ground there. So we keep it simple. Yeah, try to go ahead and get that one off. The defense got there just in time. Now, to me, the way that Surreal has played, it's kind of like a four down territory, right? So it's third and eight. If you pick up at least three to five yards, it'll help you on the fourth down that I'm almost positive Surreal is going to go for. The difference in movement right now. All looking for an opportunity. It's a bit far fetched, but we're going for it. Gotta die for it. Yes! <laughs> Man, that's one of those old plays where you have so much time that the defender that ran a route all the way deep is gonna come back. And that's the perfect opportunity for you to throw it. And the fact that he went in, got that one, converted on the big dive. Big, big play from Surreal to convert on that third and eight. Mm. In the, with the time remaining now, Surreal is in a great spot to try and make this, this comeback right now. Absolutely. I mean, and that's what we talked about, right? You've got the ball, and, you know, you control your own destiny here. Just got to make sure you don't leave too much time for Thunder. But so far, great, great drive from Thunder. Or excuse me, from Surreal here. Mm. The chat's going to get me on that one. I know. I know. <laughs> I know they will. I know They're you. They're devious today. <laughs> Two-minute warning now. What is your answer, Thunder? Surreal, once again, looking to be able to close up this game with the potential of not leaving Thunder enough time to really make this comeback if, as long as we can, cross that touchdown line. Got to maintain possession here. Don't want to force anything and throw a pick or anything like that. Yeah, with the distance we have remaining, this is where Surreal's game plan really comes into play. Play it slow. Play it safe, because interceptions like that will get you murdered. 71, I don't know if you can keep up. 17 coming in now for the interception, but not enough as well. 55 is going for a full run all the way down. What did I say before that snap? Somebody clip it. Somebody clip it, because I literally said you cannot turn the ball over, and we're going for a pick six the other way. Unfortunate. Just oh. unfortunate. Actual heartbreaker play there. I'm sorry, Mama Surreal. But here's the, here's the thing, though. Down 10, plenty of time to go ahead and get a quick score here mm. and kick the onside because you still have three minutes. So even if you don't get the onside, you have a chance to get the ball back and score. So there is still plenty of time left for Surreal to come back in this one as he's going to start off on the 25. But the run game is not going to do it. You've got to go ahead and get the passes, use the out-of-bounds line to go ahead and stop the clock and have it in your favor. Mm. But this one is not over yet. We need nothing but optimal play from the Surreal here. This is no time remaining to start playing conservative. It's now or never. Match point once again. Outside of Selena Wildcats, Thunder is looking to close this out as soon as possible. Oh, oh just a tap on the fingers.
Also got to focus on picking up the first and not just hitting home runs. Got to find that fine balance. You can see just how much Thunder wants to close out those passes. Oh, he gets one anyway. Surreal. Beautiful. He's some good distance. I like it. Picked up the yardage. I wish he would have ran out of bounds so that he could preser uh, preserve the clock a little bit. But nonetheless, the main important thing is to pick up yardage, and he's done just that. Now you got to continue and get big, big chunks on the offensive side through the aerial attack. So we're waiting for an opportunity here. Straight down the middle. Get it! You got it! Davis! Oh, no! But a finger's not now. Got to bring that one in just over his head slightly. I'm not sure what happened there. G, mama. You're forgetting my G. Our apologies. Our apologies. <laughs> hey, man, look. <laughs> now he goes ahead and runs for that one. You got to call timeout here. You're wasting precious time. I'll look for any chance. Oh, that should be good. No, we can't hang on. It's just not happening. The magic isn't there. We need one chance for Cyril to make this. But the time is slowly whittling away. Yeah, look for some routes. With some Hail Marys and streaks. Usual for the left. You know Cyril's classic. It gets the job done in terms of distance. We need a timeout. Anything. Trying to extend this clock. Make it quick. And, he'll take this the line and a slide. Well, not the ending that I'm sure G Mama Surreal had in hopes, but it looks like it's going to be Thunder. That's going to win the grand finals here between these two teams. And, I mean, you got to give props to Surreal. He did his absolute best. He had the lead. He controlled and maintained. It was just that one unfortunate interception that was thrown in that second game. I believe in that fourth quarter where he was in the red zone area. Just unfortunate to throw that pick that went to a pick six. And that kind of just gutted the opportunity for Surreal to win this one here today. That last interception just, you could feel in your heart how much that just really had to sting. And you could see just how much the real try to bring that back anyway. I mean, the potential, the confidence to really keep going. Nothing but props to our players today. They both played really great. Thunder, congratulations on the side. Man, I just can't believe how perfect that was. Like, truly, I can't be more thankful for tournaments like this, matchups like this, and the opportunity for players like this to really get the chance to just show up to a bracket when they're still in high school and play yeah. their hearts out. Yeah, I mean, no question about it. Look, shout out to Play Versus. Shout out um, to the Oklahoma Secondary School Activity Association. Shout out to G Mama Surreal, dude. I think it's incredible to have that type <laughs> of support from not just your friends, but your family, your parents. That's awesome. And I have no doubt in my mind that we will see Surreal back in the finals soon. Oh yeah, congrats again to the Selena Wildcats. This has been the Play vs. Fall 2022 High School Finals. My name is Suplex Plus. You can find me on Twitter, Twitch, whatever. India, where can we find you, dog? It's been a great time. Hey, it's just madexindia.com, or excuse me, on Twitter and on the internet, whatever the case may be. But it's been an absolute pleasure, man. Look forward to casting more games alongside you. Totally, dog. Well, that's it from us. Thanks again for the players. Play vs. Production. Truly, it's been a great day. And y'all, take care, yo.